Learn English through stories you 35 answers PDF. Adapted and modified by Kulwant Singh Sandhu. Contents Vocabulary Contests Answers 1. Complete the sentences. 1. Here's a key so that you can let yourself in. 2. Lisa doesn't like cooking, so she eats out a lot. 3. If you're in our part of town, you should drop in and say hello. 4. Could you fill in this questionnaire? It will only take 5 minutes. 5. Amy isn't living in this house anymore. She moved out a few weeks ago. 6. At your breakfast, we checked out of the hotel and got a taxi to the airport. 7. I wanted to charge my phone, but there was nowhere to plug the charger in. 8. Paul started doing a Spanish course, but he dropped out after a few weeks. 9. Be careful. The water isn't very deep here, so don't dive in. 2. Complete the sentences within, into, out, or out of. 1. I've got a new flat. I'm moving in on Friday. 2. We arrived at the hotel and checked in. 3. When are you moving into your new flat? 4. The car stopped and the driver got out. 5. Thieves broke into the house and stole some jewelry. 6. How did the thieves break in? Through a window? 7. He opened his wallet and something fell out. 8. Kate was angry and walked out of the meeting. 3. Complete the sentences using a verb plus in or out of. 1. Lisa walked to the edge of the pool, dived in and swam to the other end. 2. Not all the runners finished the race. 3 of them dropped out. 3. I went to see Joe and Sophie in their new house. They moved in last week. 4. I've told you everything you need to know. I don't think I've left out anything. 5. Some people in the crowd started singing. Then a few more people joined in and soon everybody was singing. 6. Don't be taken in by him. If I were you, I wouldn't believe anything he says. 7. I dropped in to see Laura a few days ago. She was fine. 4. Complete the sentences. Use the word in brackets in the correct form. 1. A. The fridge isn't working. B. That's because you haven't plugged it in. 2. A. What do I have to do with these forms? B. Fill them out and send them to this address. Or, fill them in and send them to this address. 3. Uh, I've made a mistake on this form. B. That's okay. Just cross it out and correct it. 4. Uh, have you been to the new club I told you about? B. No. We went there, but they wouldn't let us in because we weren't members. 5. Uh, can we meet tomorrow at 10? B. Probably. I have another meeting, but I think I can get out of it. 5. Complete the second sentence so that it means the same as the first. 1. Let's go to a restaurant tonight. B. Let's eat out tonight. 2. Why didn't you finish college? B. Why did you drop out of college? 3. Uh, please complete the application form. B. Please fill in the application form. Or please fill out the application form. 4. Uh, I can't avoid going to the party. B. I can't get out of going to the party. 5A. I thought the email was genuine, but it wasn't. B. I was completely taken in by the email. 6. A. Uh, you must come and see us sometime. B. You must drop in and see us sometime. 7. A. Uh, Steve was upset because he wasn't chosen for the team. B. Steve was upset because he was left out of the team. 
or, Steve was upset because he had been left out of the team. 6. Explain the difference in meaning between the sentences in each pair. Wanna. Jess walked into a well-paid job in the city. Jess got the job very easily. One. Jess got a well-paid job in the city. Jess got the job, but we don't know whether it was easy for her to get it or not. 2A. Raphael is heading the project team. Raphael is in charge of the project team. Fwab. Raphael is backing the project team. Raphael is supporting the project team slash giving the project team his support. Freya. Dad jumped to the wrong conclusion. Dad very quickly drew the wrong conclusion. Freeb. Dad came to the wrong conclusion. Dad drew the wrong conclusion, but we don't know whether he did so quickly or not. Fora. Jan left the room with a light heart. Jan left the room feeling happy and carefree. Forb. Jan left the room with a heavy heart. Jan left the room feeling sad and despondent. Favia. Fat chance I've got of winning. I've got no chance of winning at all. Five up. I've got a slim chance of winning. I've got a very small chance of winning. Seven. Choose the correct collocation. One. Karen's constant whistling is driving me crazy. Two. Sylvia is a first class designer as she has a good eye for detail. Three, you mustn't shoulder the heavy burden of redecorating the house all by yourself. Four, there is just a slim chance that Merrick might pop in today. Five, the committee has some weighty matters to discuss on today's agenda. Six, when the results came out, Marco was thrilled to see his name heading the list of successful candidates. Eight, complete these idioms with prepositions. 1. His company has gone from strength to strength in the last six months. He's making a lot of money now. 2. The flood ruined our old kitchen, but it was a blessing in disguise, because the insurance company paid for a completely new one. 3. This new model is not the be-all and end-all of digital cameras, but it certainly has many technical features that others do not have. 4. Your offer to drive us to the airport makes all the difference to our travel plans. 5. Your plan to persuade Lella to join the committee worked like magic. 9. Who would be most likely to say these remarks? Choose the correct answer. 1. It left its mark on me. B. Someone who taught in a very bad school for 10 years. 2. I'm a victim of my own success. C. A popular teacher whose class everyone wants to be in. 3. I don't think I'll ever hit the big time. A. Uh, a rock musician who is popular in local clubs. 4. Work isn't the be-all and end-all in my life. B. Someone who has a lot of interesting hobbies. Ten. Complete each of these idioms. 1. The photocopier has completely given up the ghost. We need a new one. 2. I didn't think I had the ghost of a chance of passing the exam, but I did. 3. My new motorbike works like a dream, it's fast, but so smooth and quiet. Or, my new motorbike goes like a dream, it's fast, but so smooth and quiet. Or, my new motorbike runs like a dream, it's fast, but so smooth and quiet.